Hey everybody! In today's video, I'm going to show you an awesome way to adhere your stencils and masks while you're working with a messy medium like powdered watercolor. You guys know I love powdered watercolor, but it can get under the mask sometimes. So I coated this mask, this gorgeous floral mask, with the adhesive spray from ThermoWeb. It's a very light tack repositionable adhesive, but it keeps it very firmly on your watercolor paper and prevents things from leaking under the edges and destroying the crispness of your design. This is Orange County powdered watercolor. The next one is Are You Cerise? Their names crack me up. And you just want to be very sparing with these. You'll see you get a ton of color from just a few little sprinkles. I'm just trying to make sure there's color around every edge of this gorgeous little mask. This one is a bit jaded. And then where all the magic happens, just spray it with water. It will activate the pigments and the little walnut crystals. And I just want to be careful to get water all around the edges of the mask. That's what's going to give me the crispness. And see how much water I'm adding and how that could potentially leak under the stencil without this spray. But you will see it is perfectly preserved, the entire shape. Now I'm going to take a towel. I love to do this with these. And I'm just going to blot up some of the color and all of the water. This can sort of lighten up the intensity of the watercolor, but also you don't want to move a mask that has water on it. And I didn't feel like sitting here for two hours while this dried, and I'm sure you don't feel like sitting here for two hours. But you can see how easily the masks remove with the spray and how crisp that image is. It's absolutely perfect. So I love this product. I'm glad Ileana told me about it. Then I just did a little zentangling inside the shapes that it left. And you can see more over on the My Sweet Petunia blog today. Thanks so much for watching.